Yeah. That's so sweet. Everyone's thinking, well, what did, what did you get her for Valentine's Day, right? Oh, is that what they think? You think that's what they're thinking? I failed to get him birthday presents or even celebrate his birthday. Good luck with whatever it is. So I'll show you what I got for Katie. Good morning, everybody, and happy Wednesday. Today's a big Wednesday. It is both Ash Wednesday and Valentine's Day all at the same time, and my brother's birthday, and we're having a live tonight. If you guys haven't joined Patreon and want to chat live with us, please join um, Patreon. Take a look at the link below. We are having a live family meeting tonight and going to be able to chit chat with um, all of our folks who are um, members of the fam club. So join us. Anyway, in the meantime, Mike and I are getting ready to go to church for Ash Wednesday. Ryan is at school. I just finished um, a two-day trip, an amazing two-day trip flying um, that brought me back here. Actually, I had an overnight here, which was so great. So Mike came and joined me. We did a little staycation downtown in our beautiful town here in Florida. That was great. So um, I am here for the next few days, actually. Uh, I won't be flying again. Well, I don't know. I might be flying this weekend. I was supposed to go to Tallahassee this weekend with Mike, but I might not do that. Hi, Mike. It's another day we're to sell, Joe. It is. Happy Valentine's Day, my love. Thank you, darling. You're welcome. You're, you're, my, my, you're my love. You're my Valentine's Day. Aww. That's so sweet. Everyone's thinking, well, what did, what did you get her for Valentine's Day, right? Oh, is that what they think? You think that's what they're thinking? Think Mike, let me tell you, Mike is taking me out to this beautiful dinner tomorrow night. We are going with another couple friends of ours. It's called, a, it's like a wine pairing dinner. So it's a very fancy, fancy dinner that I'm very excited about. So it's a four course meal, I think, and they pair it with four different wines. I know. You are quite the, um, what do you call it? Uh, Casanova. Is Don that? Juan. Don Juan. <laughs> I don't know. They might be the same person. Huh. If you guys know, can you please comment down below? Don Juan. Let's ask our, um, let's ask our uh, tonight on Patreon. Okay, yeah. we can do that. Excellent. All right, so we're going to head out to church and then um, I have to eat something. I haven't eaten yet. I'm very hungry. Eggies. I'll eat some eggies. Yeah, Mike bought the little eggs instead of the big eggs. So we have little baby eggs. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's plenty of big ones. No, I ate the big ones. Look. First. Let me big one. Oh, are those two big over there? And then the little baby ones. Like, teeny Small ones. Ones are tiny little baby <laughs> eggs. They're sweeter. <laughs> you are. All right. See you later. All right, we left church. Now I'm out and about. I dropped Mike back at home. I'm out and about doing some shopping. And let me explain to you what happened. Mike's birthday was in November. And it was such a crazy time because it was right after Thanksgiving. And I failed to get him birthday presents or even celebrate his birthday. I failed to make him his cake. We were gonna try to do it. If you haven't watched the video, I will link it here. We were gonna try to do a trip with him to Plymouth, to see Plymouth Rock and get a lobster roll, but that kind of failed miserably. So now I'm out and about. I have a bunch of gifts for him and um, we're gonna celebrate tonight with a combined Thanksgiving, I'm sorry, a combined Valentine's Day and birthday celebration tonight. So I was at Trader Joe's today getting a few items for Valentine's Day and for Mike's birthday. And this girl who was checking me out, she was like, I mean like checking me out like when I was paying. She goes, um, you have something on your forehead. I just, I just, she was so cute. She goes, I just didn't want you to walk around with that not knowing that you had that on your forehead. I said, oh no, it's okay. I went to church this morning. It's Ash, it's Ash Wednesday. So it's the beginning of Lent and we put it on our forehead. Oh, Okay, <laughs> I felt so bad for her. It was so cute because she just wanted to help me out, which was very, very kind. Um, so hopefully um, this isn't bothering you guys. This is a sign of um, our Christian faith. So anyway, I am back now and I wanted to show you what I got for Mike. I got him quite a few things only because I kind of felt guilty for missing his birthday. And um, that again was in November and it is now February. So hold on one second. I'm gonna show you guys all the stuff I got for Mike. Stay right here. Okay, I also got some things for Katie and for Ryan. Where's Ryan's? Hold on one second. I got, I didn't get anything for Brennan yet for Valentine's Day because I just can't think of what to get him. Hold on, let me get Ryan's. 
Okay, I'm back. So I didn't want to go overboard with the kids because it's just Valentine's Day. It's not like, I mean, they just had Christmas and whatever. So I'll show you what I got for Katie. I got her this at Epcot. I thought it was the cutest thing ever. Look, it's a little like flower ring holder or whatever. You can put that on the side of your bed or whatever. I just thought it was the cutest thing ever. It's a little cherry blossom. I got it in the Japanese pavilion at Epcot. So that's for Katie Lady. And I also got her these little glasses. They're wine glasses or water glasses or whatever kind of glasses you want them to be. But they have little hearts on them. And she has her little her own little apartment. So I thought she would totally enjoy those. They were just really cute. So those two things for Katie Lady. And then for Rye Guy, again, when we were at Epcot at Disney, I bought Mike. I'm going to jump over. I bought Mike this um, perfume. What is it called? cologne and it came with this little guy too so he's a little sample so i'm gonna give him to ryan and i'm gonna give this to ryan i know you guys might hear me shut the door because i don't want to hear so this might be kind of crazy but he loves making cookies if you've been watching for a while you know he's a cookie guy so this is a cookie dough scoop so um look at that i saw it hanging there and i was like oh i have to get that for ryan oh it's valentine's day let me do that so i got that for ryan and then um I got these for me, not because I needed a Valentine's Day gift, but just because for work, our logo is a heart for Southwest. And I always like to have a cute little pen that I use when I'm taking orders for drinks. Um, so I had a heart one for Valentine's Day, but it broke. But I can still use hearts throughout the season or throughout the rest of the year because it's Southwest. So I bought these for myself. That's fun. And then I did buy another something for myself because when I travel, um, I need to have clothes that I can change into when I get to the destination. Like if I want to go out to dinner or if I want to walk around with my crew and we want to go visit the city and that kind of thing. So I need clothes that don't wrinkle and I need clothes that um, can be used for all different weather because I never know if I'm going to be going, sometimes I don't know if I'm going to be going to a warm destination or a cold destination. And also um, I want something that's comfortable. So I got these pants, which I absolutely love. They're so soft. They are Max Studio. I went to Nordstrom Rack and I got these. They're like wide leg um, army green. And then I got the same pair in black. Very cute. So I'm very, very happy with them. They're so, so comfortable. So they can go from like casual to dressy if we were going to go to a nice place. Um, and then I got these two t-shirts that go, they're like stretchy. So there's a blue one and a white one that I can wear with those. And then for Michael, so for the main event, here we go. Ready? I got him his favorite coffee, which is Dunkin' Donuts Hazelnut. He loves this coffee. Of course, I got him the Dolce & Gabbana, um, cologne. And I got him this little, like, these are, what are they called? incense bamboo incense and the flavor is sandalwood it smells so good i got that at the epcot pavilion too and it has this little incense holder so there's a little hole here and you put the incense stick in there and it burns and drops down here but then you can also when you're done with it but you but it's not finished yet you lay it right in this little crack right there that's at least how i think it works so i got him that because he loves good smelly things and I got him a pair of pants. These are nice dress pants. There's a J. Crew outlet near us that is like addictive and they have great sales. And I had a coupon, so I kind of went hog wild on some clothes for Mike. I got him those pants. I got him these pants. Nice, just like I call them khakis, but they're not khaki in color, but I think they're called like gray khakis. Can you do that? Can you call them that? <laughs> Oh my gosh. And then blue khakis as well. I like those. And then I love this shirt. I hope he likes it. I love this shirt. It goes great with the blue pants and the gray pants too. Isn't that cute? Really, really cute. So I shouldn't say cute. I should say handsome because I'm not sure Mike's going to appreciate having a cute shirt. And then, you know, he is the king of quarter zip. So we got him another quarter zip just in case he might like it. He always wears, um, what is it, Tommy Bahama ones. But the this one was a J. Crew, and I'm going to see if he likes it. It's so soft. I like it a lot. I love the color. If he likes it, maybe he'll wear it out to dinner tonight or tomorrow night for our Valentine's Day dinner. 
So I have to wrap all these things. So I'm gonna give them to them tonight. And I was supposed to make a cake while he was swimming and I failed miserably on that. So I might, I'm gonna wrap first. Actually, maybe I should make the cake first and wrap while it's baking. I think that's what I do. I'll make the cake first. And then um, surprise him with a Valentine's Day and birthday dinner. Yay! Mike's favorite birthday cake is one that is, it's a regular just chocolate cake. And then his mom has this icing that she would use for the cake, like the frosting. And it's in a recipe that is somewhere. This is what my, here it is right here. Look at that. You guys, this is my recipe book. It is an absolute mess. I decided one time to take all my recipes and put it in like a photo album. This is an old photo album. So I have like printed out ones. I have a bunch of them stapled together. And then I have all these different recipes in here. But tried and true, I've had it for years and it works beautifully. So anyway, this is the recipe for his, the frosting for Mike's favorite birthday cake, which I think is disgusting, but it brings back memories and his mom made it and so I do now too. One package of Dream Whip in a box, whipped topping mix, one package of instant chocolate pudding, one cup of cold milk, and then beat with a mixer. So I have the instant jello pudding and i have the dream up what i don't know is if i can, if i have a cup of milk actually to be honest <gasps> guess what i think we do sweet we have a cup of milk all right i'm gonna make this whip this up and we'll ice the cake when it's done <laughs> all right so i wanted to make sure to make that cake while mike was swimming so he didn't see it because i'm always about the surprise so he does no idea. He just got back from swimming, but he has no idea that there's cake in the oven. It's tea time. Are you supposed to be doing your homework? Yeah, I know. I'm home around. So. You are? It's very urgent. Oh, okay, Caitlin. Good luck with whatever it is. All right, so this is the deal. Like I said, this is the hard part because I'm going to wrap Mike's gifts. But this is what our storage unit looks like right now because... Mike took down all the Christmas decorations and I was supposed to put them away, but I was traveling, traveling, traveling. So look at like, we literally, this box after box after box after box. And somewhere in here is the gift wrap. Actually, I think it's this box right here has the like gift boxes and gift wrap and that kind of stuff in it. So somehow I've got to dig out and get into there and get some gift boxes out so I can wrap my gifts. <sighs> That's Little gifties, gifties. All right, you guys, and this is the cake. I'm telling you, I told you it was so gross, but it's this is how it turned out. I mean, it's first of all, I did my writing is not the best, but happy birthday, which is the B and Valentine's Day to my lovey love. <laughs> I hope you love all mm. of your, your gifts. It's the epic gifts. I need to, <laughs> well, on the cake. <laughs> That's a great. All right, very good. So Ryan went out to the movies with his friends, and we just finished our live on Patreon, our family, our family meeting, our live stream. So much fun. Join us. Yes, I told them in the beginning of the video. Join us on Patreon. We have a great time. Once a month, we do our family meetings. At least once a month. Great people. Great people on Patreon. We take a lot of advice from them. We do. Yes, we had a heart to heart tonight, and got some feedback on that. Anyway. Um, we're gonna open Mike's gonna open his presents. We're gonna eat some sushi and just celebrate a very no, nice Valentine's Day. You're absolutely welcome, love. Mike opened all of his gifts. Mike, what was your favorite gift that you opened? Um, I like everything. It's like really, yeah. 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 Thank yeah. you, sweetie. You're welcome, and you smell good. A little over the top. Oh, but you know what? It's a Celebration, it's a combined. Look at. <laughs> hey, where are my... Michael will not use regular porcelain plates. 
He only used paper plates, but we're out of paper plates, so look what he did. He brought diamond paper out. Like, this is literally wax paper. I am not gonna eat a piece of cake off of wax paper. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Michael. And Valentine's Day. Happy birthday, Valentine's Day to you. Thanks. You're welcome, baby. Nice.